Hello everyone. Thank you for coming to Mary's Little House again to that, this evening. So glad to have you all with me. It's what a grace and blessing to have you. Uh, I, tonight I want to talk about mental prayer. Uh, mental prayer is, is different than oral prayer or prayer with words. Uh, like uh, the Our Father, the Hail Mary, we need that. We need those prayers. Uh, but mental prayer is using our mind and our and our heart. Uh, we 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 think of God and uh, God is so good, and our hearts attracted to that goodness. So our mind and our heart, mental prayer. Okay, that's what we're talking about, mental prayer. So uh, I, I and I want just to give you some helps to mental prayer. Okay, uh, first of all. Uh, uh, you have to have a time, you know, a, a date with God that you have to be consistent with. Uh, like I get up at 3 a.m., from 3 a.m. to 4 a.m., I, I sit in front of an icon or, or no, a picture of the Holy Shroud of Jesus uh, 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 the, uh, from his waist up. I, I can see his wound uh, where he was pierced with a sword. I can see his face. He was all beat up and his nose was broken. I mean, it, it, I, I look at that, at Jesus. It's just a sign of how much he loved us to go through all this, to suffer so much. I, that is my uh, focus and um, of my visual focus uh, 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 looking at the uh, uh, this this picture. Uh, it, uh, I sit in front of that uh, uh, to pray. Okay, now, uh, so a time. So... So choose a time when you could. It might might be an hour and start maybe start out with a half hour or fifteen minutes as much as you can, but it's got to be there on time and 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 end on time too. Uh, but I'll get to the beginning and end. The place well, place should be a, a place where you won't be interrupted and um, and and it, it's a reverent place uh, and a chair, not a big lounging chair, but. I like a kitchen chair. I got an old oak chair f from the thrift store, and it's just so strong, and and it, it it's just, it's a wooden, you know, wooden uh, from, from, the kitchen, from a kitchen chair, and 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 you can sit straight, uh, straight erect, you know, and your feet are planted uh, firmly on the ground, you know, so so you're not lounging around. It just helps. I, I'll just tell you, it helps. Just believe it. To sit uh, uh, straight and erect. And, and your feet planted on the ground. Uh, relax though, relax. It's not, you know, like a t tin soldier, you know, don't have to uh, be attention, but just relax and just, uh, just relax. Okay, so time and place. Uh, as I mentioned, you, it might, might be a crucifix or an icon or uh, a picture of Jesus uh, that helps you to focus on him and talk to him, you know. We need that. Uh, because we're face-to-face -face people, God made us to encounter and and and, and to converse with the, our with 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 others. And when now we're conversing with Jesus, the one who loves us the most. The next is spiritual reading. Now, prayer is not for spiritual reading, but sometimes people come with they don't know what to think about or anything. And spiritual reading is a help, a means. It's not the end to to prayer. So, so the, and, and the greatest spiritual book, I mean, hello, is the Bible, you know. And, 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 and I always tell people to start with the Gospels. Just see how Jesus is and watch him, how he handles this, uh, Jai, the Jairus and his daughter, you know, and, and uh, the little 12-year-old. How, how wonderful he is. You talk to him, you know, about it, you know. And that, that, that uh, 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 but when you get a, a thought or an inspiration, an insight, stop there and talk to Jesus about it. Uh, work it over, you know, and say, Jesus, you're really nice to Jairus. You, you could have, uh, you know, uh, oh, a cured her from a distance, but you, you came to the house. You, you got all those people that were wailing it out. You you brought your Jairus and his wife up to, uh, to the uh, to the room where the little girl was supposed to be dead. Anyway, then you went over to take her hand, how precious her little hand, and and uh, call her uh, to Talitha Kumi to little girl get up, and she did, and 
and you were so considerate you gave it to her parents uh, and her to the parents and asked her food she was hungry she had, didn't eat for a long time so we'll give her something they but th that's the kind of thing and, and 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 that's the way we get started that's called discursive uh um a meditation you know as you go along i'm just as i'm running ahead of myself after a while you know you don't need a lot of help you know yes we if we read the scriptures we hear it in the homily or we hear it in the re readings of uh, mass and things but but you're constantly feeding putting kindling in by your spiritual reading and and things like that uh, but you pray you, you get to not need it as much and you just are there present with Jesus and that we'll get onto that advanced kind of prayer but uh, it's just there you're just there you know I I I books are a distraction to me now when I go to before the Blessed Sacrament Jesus the art at the icon is because he's he's so good and he's so good to be with and you don't need words and anything anyway so okay so a, pr a crucifix or an icon or something on the t on your prayer table there they are on the wall I have a picture on the wall and sit with my well, my wooden kitchen ta a kitchen uh, chair well, it's really nice real strong and mm, you could sit there really erect okay uh, okay okay now what are you gonna do you, you're there you, you, you got your Bible there, or, or your spiritual reading book, or whatever. Uh, you gotta get started, and you get started. Uh, get started. Uh, that's Peanut. He's, yeah, uh, Peanut, are you okay? He's somebody might be at the door. But anyway, uh, uh, he, he's a good watchdog. Uh, it, when you get started, so so uh, what I suggest, what I suggest is. Starting off with a Hail Mary. Please, Blessed Mother will help us pray, uh, help us encounter Jesus. If anyone knows Jesus uh, more, it's the Blessed Mother, the Blessed Mother of all the human kind. Of course, the Eternal Father knows Jesus more, but, and the Holy Spirit. But the Blessed Mother, anyone, uh, anyone that, that uh, so, so Mary will help us. So start out with the Hail Mary, start on time, and then, and then think, uh, Start, uh, uh, think, uh, uh, read or something, or um, uh, 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 and then then, then uh, carry that idea. Think about it. Talk to Jesus about it. You know, and then and and then a stop reading and when you find something that hits you that strikes you and talk about it. And this is another thing. It's uh, once that hour or that half hour up or that fifty minutes that you agreed on with Jesus is up. Stop. Say the Lord's Prayer. If it's the Lord's Prayer. The, we're, we're going to the Father in, in this life. Our whole journey is to the Father, to the Father's house. Jesus is accompanying us. He's ahead of us, you know, uh, showing us the way. So, um, the Our Father, so our, all our prayer goes to the Father. So, so end with the Our Father. So, the two bookends is Hail Mary in the beginning, get into prayer, and she's a spouse of the Holy Spirit. She'll help you with the Holy Spirit. Now. And, and our Father at the end, and end on time, because sometimes people want to end, uh, end early because oh, it's a it's a disaster. We're distracted. We don't want to be here. Uh, Saint Teresa of Avila said that she used to have to almost tie herself to her chair until the hourglass glass, the last grain of sand fell in the bottom of the hourglass, because sometimes it's very hard to stay. But we we show God our fidelity even when we're not getting anything. And we're distracted, or we're sleepy, or we're upset. Doesn't even matter. We're there. We hang out. We we stay with them until the end. Or the other opposite thing. Oh, we're so filled with all these thoughts and everything. We want to stay with you forever, like Peter said uh, at Mount Thabor. I will. Let's build some tents here. We're, we're gonna we're gonna camp here, man. Because this is great to see you They're like this. This is wonderful. No, no. We got to get to back to bed or get to work or whatever. But if so, we got to stop, even though the consolations are pouring on and everything at the right time. 
God will take care of the consolations. They're doing their work. They're strengthening our faith. They're they're giving us a hope and all that. They're, 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 they're got, but we've got to be faithful and stop at the right time and say the Lord's Prayer and, and get with the business of the day or go back to bed or whatever you're doing, the next thing you're doing. I'm so glad. These are just this little uh, hints uh, or helps to to pray better. God bless you, dear. I will we'll continue on this. Uh, have a nice evening. God bless you. Bye-bye.